you be my It's the done, the done, done I still got a lot of shit to learn, I'll admit Yo, 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 what's up people, Tasman here, welcome back to the World of Warcraft Classic with Mollip. We was going to do a quest, it don't look like it now, it looks like we're doing some Marathi Basin. <gasps> Why the hell not? So, while we're waiting to get this going, we'll get some, uh, we'll get some poisons on, so we're going to go for instant, instant poison rank 3. No less. Yeah, that's one of the things that I'm uh, not sure whether or not I've ever mentioned. We're going to put Crippling in the offhand. We're now level 38. We're very close to 39. I carried on just grinding uh, out the Magram Centaurs in, uh, in Desolus. So I got my reputation up to the friendly, so I was able to unlock uh, the low-level quest there, which great um, and I've been just going around sort of farming up stuff to put in the auction house as you can see we're back up to 135 uh, gold pieces and you know just handing in a few shit bits you know places where there's like one or two quests which is actually what we're going to be doing today uh, I've got a quest I've got three elite quests but we've got one singular quest uh, to be getting on with in Arathi Oh, oh, oh. Okay, how this turns out, I don't know. Historically, we're doing really bad uh, in Arathi Basin. I've won one. In all the times that I've been in there, we've won once. And the trouble we're finding is that people are going and... They seem to be caring more about assaults than defending, which is just ridiculous. Just ridiculous. So although this uh, 12 go BS, 2 gold gold mine. Yeah, that's a winning recipe straight away, isn't it, that is. You know, there's been several where I've got down to the stable and no one's taken it. They've all gone that way or that way and no one's bothered to take the stables. It looks like someone's going to this time... Yeah, they're doing it. Well done. Okay, so we've got quite a few heading this way. Got a few heading that way. It's a start. Want we'll to leave blacksmith? Leave the blacksmith. Go to the lumber mill. Keck bot group. How can you tell? Now usually I'll just stay at the stables and defend because someone needs to, but we've got a couple of people there. Go GM, don't go blacksmith. Right, someone's thinking. Someone's thinking. We'll get out the flags. I don't know if it's ours or theirs. No, defend, 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 defend. Defend three, nice. Oh. was that? Okay, got the lumber mill. We've got defenders here. Nice. Why have you assaulted the farm? Just sacrifice the lumber mill. 
and the mine, and that's the problem. That is the problem. You know, if you stop at the lumber mill and gold mine and defend the shit out of it, you win. Are you leaving? Then I'm defending. You see, now this one saying that, this was the person that was right to defend the, you know, gold mine and lumber mill, lovely, don't go blacksmith. But that's also the same person, with all the worldly good advice, that went to the farm. the lumber mill again and the farm and the mine <laughs> okay so you two idiots Right, cat therapist from Shazra, fucking stay there. Did you, you're the two that died at the blacksmith, eh? Yeah, they've gone, where are you going? like go GM yeah but not everybody <laughs> wow I did originally want to get the <coughs> the boots um, but the rep you need with the League of Aratha or Ratha however you want to put it these ones it's so difficult to get still neutral You know, if I need honoured or even revered, it just it's just not going to happen at any point in our lifetime. We certainly won't hit 60 if we stay and grind it. I just want to maintain getting the at least 15 honourable kills a day to maintain standing, really. So far I've got two honourable kills, which was for yesterday. Does make it a bit difficult because obviously when you're defending times like this there's nothing here. First sergeant. See, I'm sergeant at the moment, rank three. So first sergeant must be uh, the next one. Oh, thank you. You see, you see how we didn't lose the stables then. GM lost. I'm not surprised if you've all fucked off. Yeah, two people there. That's why.
because he didn't see me. Went straight past. It's nice to have a bait about. It's a mage. We weren't going to do anything to the mage. Might sap it. They got a rogue twink. Great. Someone who got to 39 and went, No, I don't want my mount. I'm going to stay here and twink. Alright then. You'd have thought with the release of Burning Crusade and that, you'd have thought twinking would have become a little bit. a bit rarer, really. Because you want to get to that. Those old twinks. I'm hearing the pings, but I'm not seeing the pings. Uh, here we go. Each one of these horde that are coming up to the stables, pleb. You know, you don't take the stables or for a, in our instance the farm, unless you are hammering it down and blitz everything. Then you take it to hold them back. You literally leave it till last. If you haven't got all the others, it's not worth doing. Just not worth doing. And I really fail to see why anybody else is unable to see that. Don't get it. Defend three, win. It's not difficult. I can lose the mine again. We've got loads of people there. We're gonna need more. person would be best served standing here. Look how many people we've got dead at the moment. And I can appreciate from watching this, um, it might not be that entertaining. I do apologise. But if I get a win, I can hand three marks in. If I get a loss, then I've got to do a Rathi Basin at least two more times. Or two more losses. There we go. Fucking brilliant. We're in the lead, but for how long? They're trying to take the blacksmith. Okay, we have the farm, but we're about to lose. It might be alright. 
Getting a few defenders coming up. Or are they just people that have died? Yeah. People that have died and moved on. My hand's very clammy. Ah, here we go. Is this... Stable incoming. Some cool down. Is that all of them? Don't chase, stay. They have to come to us. Makes so much difference. The last time I was in here, I think I was 32, 34. I did awful. I think we're fighting some shit down here, but I didn't leave. We are about... All of you festering fuck tits, get back up to the lumber mill. Hold it. No, they want the farm. They are about to overtake. Problem there. Still got the lumber mill. See, I'm starting to get a bit bored as well, but I know that if I move, I'll regret it.
Well. See, that's the thing. It's no good having the right idea in the chat and then completely ignore your own advice and go and take the farm anyway. You need to actually take three. Hold three. Win. As soon as you try to take a four, you are thinning your defences. You are gonna lose out at some point. You know, three groups of five... Three bases. How is it that hard? Got that many people over there and they're not taking it. Here he comes. And he's only level 36. No. Going straight on by. You don't feel that there's enough people at the gold mine. Oi! frustrating it is frustrating so what are we get in so we're right down the bottom three killing blows seven honorable kills I've got a death it's 700 and 272 lovely honor healing cape, but I keep running back. I'm trying to regroup. Embly, where are you going? love to show you guys a win. I really would. No, nope, they've all given up and come up here. Does that mean there's hoarding coming? Defend two and lose, boy. Go. We're not going to win. Oh, if I get incoming. Got an honourable kill then, so someone got close. really holding the front. That many of you could easily take the blacksmith. If, you know, if the gold mines become that impenetrable, and that's why you choose that one, because once you've got it, it's... I don't think it's that easy to uh, take back if it's got defenders. 
because you can only get to it from two places like the blacksmith you can get to it from all over lumber mills two places this one's three you know take the places it's easiest to defend I think fuck the blacksmith Coming round here. That's what I'm talking about. Sit the fuck down. I don't know whether that was classed as mine or not. Cooldown of my sprint is now 3.5 seconds. You lucky, lucky boy. Not about you. What the fuck is that? Oh my word. Didn't fucking kill me though. Yeah, so. Okay. How many kills? If it's over 15, then I'm happy. If it's not, the tears should come falling. No, we don't want another one. We got 10. Fuck. No matter, that is fine. So, today's episode, because <laughs> I think what, I've, what I'd have done, which you'll probably already know by now because you'll have seen it, will be like just to cut out the long parts where I was uh, waiting. Because it was just defending, I stayed at the stables, so yeah. So that means we've got time left in this episode to go and crack on and get this uh, Trelane's Wand of Invocation. Oh no. He's left us. Good. Good. To say we lost that, to be honest, I quite enjoyed that uh, Arathi Basin. Simply because when I did come across something, I was uh, able to kill it. But fucking hell, some of them, the movement impairing effects are beastly. And sometimes a touch OP, I have to say. So we need to head on down to the ogres down here. And I'm going to go roughly in the direction of where I found the mithril. Because we want some mithril. In fact, I want lots of Mithril, because I want to make the Mithril Blunderbuss gun uh, with my engineering, because it has an additional 5 agility on it. 
which uh, well means everything to me. Just means everything to me. However, it doesn't look like it's currently there. So now I'm not entirely sure if this is a a pickup. I don't know if it's a drop. I have no idea but either way it's definitely not on the brutes but because we do want to get some more XP let's have a word with them My bloody poisons has just run out hasn't it So, I'm going to go with instant on poise, instant on both, because these don't run away. Okay, the Magnus doesn't have it either. So now I am confused. Oh, we have a chest. Oh, shit. Not bad. Now, during my uh, grind, and it was against the level 31, uh, I did top my crit, my highest crit. Uh, we got a 710, and the only other time we went above 700 was 704. Um, it was only the two that I got. I'm still going to count the 653, because it wasn't during a video, uh, which obviously means everything. But, I have seen it get to 710, so I know that it is... We are capable. We are very capable. Okay, we're assuming it's in here then. Okay, according to the map it is. Mulgore Spiced Bread. That's, uh... That's lovely. I'm just going to wait for that to run out. what I'd have liked with loads of ore, really. I've got plenty of iron, um, to the point in which I've managed to send a shit ton of iron to my bank character ready for TBC. So I've got to be honest, I really just want to for Possibly true silver if I can pick that up yet. I'm not too sure what it is. I know that it, we're covering on 194. Bit delayed, but no matter. Nice. to this it's not that way not a single mining node in here I'm gonna pull this one back
I can't see anyone else there. Let's pull this last brute over. Okay, it is a boss. Fair enough. Fair enough. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh. Oh. I only apologise. Right. Core Gresh Cold Rage. You sound like someone who's going down. Not with hits like that. Just unnecessary, isn't it? Some of that. Okay, we've got the wand. Oh, iron plate. Yep. So up for iron. Iron for days. I'm not. I want Mithril. You know, my engineering really is at a halt until I get, like, a shit ton of Mithril. That hurt a tiny bit. But I think it'd probably be better just move on. Now I've got a couple of other quests that I need to do. Um Okay, nothing to do with me. Um that are in Alterac Mountains that we pick up from South Shore. And it's the Noble Deaths. Uh, for the Alterac Signets and what's it called? Dark Council or something like that uh, where we need to get four Argus Mages and they go all the way up uh, to the top I can't remember what it's called but the top of Alterac Mountains uh, close to the lake and then there's another something in there like a quest to pick up and an orc's head we need to get we've got a few to do so that's my intention really as soon as I get past this spidster that is my intention quite right because at the moment we're in we're in limbo it's awful I mean a lot of uh, the guildies during these uh, specific moments uh, in leveling when it is just a pain in the tits uh, to pay for boosts now now we've got a couple of guildies that are 60 uh, they are offering uh, to boost me and I am going to have to 
I'm going to have to say yes. Definitely. Uh, I was kind of hoping to get the Scarlet Monastery done tonight, but the times of us logging in didn't quite tally. But I need to do a full Scarlet Monastery. All the bosses. Um, well, you know, library, armour and cathedral. Uh, to get the In the Name of the Light quest done. Really need to get that done. But say we are just we're just stuck in limbo at the moment because we can't we can't get the level forty odd quests. They're pretty tough even if uh, we do. And we got um, you know we've got nothing but scattered crap all over the place. It's it's really been a struggle. Okay, well, let's hand this in. 3k XP, no, that's a bit tardier, definitely. Find an azure a gate and bring it to Apprentice Crichton on the Red Dwarf at Refuge Point. Okay. So, where is this ship from? To do that, we're going to need some gems from the Boulderfist Shaman. Uh to come to the tower, but they're not going to stay there in position too long. The tower of Aretha. Off with you. Oh, shit. Not another one up here, is it? What's right around here? And it's an elite. Great. Great. So we're not going to be doing any of those. Radon Cold Card, this is one that I got from getting my rep up to friendly and then uh, once we spoke to the Galkis they gave us this quest to get the crew charms it's a green quest probably a good idea to smash it out at some point it's just that it's all the way back in Desolus so just try not to the Badlands Regent run that we can do in the Badlands because it's it's a bad but as you can see it's very scattered all over and just an awful drop rate absolute awful drop rate uh, I'm currently doing that quest on my priest and I've got the coyote fangs but the buzzards don't seem to want to drop their gizzards and that's uh, say it's given me a tough time on the priest and then obviously the veil which I'd rather not do because it's just as gank worthy as the private servers is absolute awful at the moment I've got to be honest there has been times when uh, Horde 60s have gone and just run on past, but now, whenever I've been in the Vale, that's just a fucking rarity. You know, it's hard to get through Booty Bay without getting ganked at the moment. So I'm a bit reluctant to go there. So I think, as it's closer, it's going to be Alterac Mountains, and I'm going to be doing that in the next episode. So thanks an awful lot for watching. I do really appreciate it. Let me know what you think in the comments, and I'll see you all in the next one.